Hi, I'm Janice. I teach science here in Clearwater, Florida, and today I'm here to talk to you about how you calculate the density of a molecule. Now, density is a measurement, and it's a measurement of mass over volume. Now, in the scientific world, we like to use the metric system, so typically when we're talking about mass, we measure that in grams. And when it comes to density, we actually measure the volume in milliliters which is a relatively small amount if you've ever looked at a graduated cylinder. So let's say that I wanted to figure out what the density of aluminum was. Well, maybe I have a ball of aluminum foil and I weigh it and it weighs 27 grams. Well, one of the ways pe people typically calculate how much volume something takes up is they would drop it in a graduated cylinder. So I could take my piece of aluminum foil, I could wad it up into a ball, drop it into a graduated cylinder, and let's say that it displaced 10 milliliters of water. Remember, density is mass divided by volume, so I would take 27, I would divide it by 10, and that's going to give me a number that's 2.7. And that is, in fact, the density of aluminum. So, grams divided by milliliters is how you calculate the density of a molecule. I'm Janice. Have a great day.